Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to edit the shop policies on Etsy website. So, first of all, of course, all you need to do is just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. So, of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser, could be possibly working for you. So, once you actually open your browser, just go here to the URL section and type etsy.com and hit the enter button. That will actually take you into this page. Uh, of course, if you're logging into your account, you'll find a sentence here, welcome back, and that will be just your name or your username, whatever. So, of course, if you are not logged in into your account or you don't even have an account, you'll find an option called sign in at the top right corner. Just go and click on it. And of course, from there, you'll be able to log in into your account or even create an account if you don't have one. Of course, you'll be able to do one of those with your Google account, Facebook account, or even your Apple account if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of creating or logging in into your account. So once you did that, as we said, you'll find yourself here at this home or at this main page. So as you said in the beginning of the video, if you would like to edit your shop policies, simply you'll need to go to your shop manager at the top right corner here, just go and click on it once, and of course here you will find yourself here. So from this option you will need to go or from this page you'll need to go to settings click on it and here you would like to go to policy settings so of course here you'll find the return and exchange policies the cancellation policies the privacy policies and the fixed policies so of course go to whatever specific thing you would like to and you can create a policy or edit one if you already have it so just go and choose if you want to edit whatever you want, return or ex and exchange, cancellation, privacy and fixed and do whatever you want with them. So that will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching it. Goodbye.